Okay, hey guys. So, Rank Games are back, and I thought that's a good opportunity to make another tutorial uh, about how to play on Rank Games. This time I'm going to talk about Chappelle. <laughs> and yeah, I will start as uh, an attacker and show you some spots and some tactics and uh, some moves I like to use, but I won't go too much into detail about this. And yeah, just I'm going to start straight ahead. I, at first I like to, if uh, for the attacking side, uh, if, if one Merc goes over here, to c keep the balcony area clean, so they can't take the spot in front of the balcony. Uh, I like to do it with Nader. Nader is pretty awesome to just to spam nades in there. It's not about killing the enemy team, it's just about keeping it back. Then, okay, for sure, an engineer for the repair, and probably together with the medic. And two mate teammates going on the right side, medic tank combo, that's also good. Uh, you don't want to get the uh, def uh, defending team to get uh, the garage. If they get into the garage, you're in trouble, you, you fucked up the first objective. They place a heal station and an ammo station here, and it's really hard to get them out of it. So, uh, the person up here has to make sure no one jumps down here. And if, someone's jump if someone jumps down at the beginning, the engineer and the medic have to take care of them before, before they do anything else. Okay, once you repair the UE, it's probably it will probably be taken out <laughs> right here. Because the enemy team will spam their airstrikes. And it's pretty much still the same. You've got to get control of the balcony area here and the balcony area over there. And just a, a little push. If you get that, you can push the EV. One really important key point for the whole uh, EV escort thing is you've got to be really aggressive. You don't find uh, behind the EV, you always fight in front of the EV. The more aggressive you are, the better the chances are for you to, to, to win it. So, if someone's repairing the EV, uh, your fight should already take place over here. Or if the enemy team is wiped out, uh, you can always start to fight here. Maybe with an air strike, with nades or something, so they don't come even close to the EV. And only the engineers record the EV. Uh, well next time your we uh, will be taken out is probably around this area, or maybe even here, uh, between the bridges, or at the end of it. If it's taken out here, you don't uh, camp behind the EV and start fighting to go on the turret or something. You've got to push again, be really aggressive. You've got to fight into the and the red building, you've got to take control of this area. You've got to get up here. You've got to fight here. Uh, if you have trouble, trouble and the enemy is, team is already in, you can go for the flank, you can go around it, you can drive coming from here and shooting people over here and here. Yeah, that's what you should do. Next time you uh, then again wipe out the team, push the AV. Uh, the we will probably be taken out here again. Then again, be aggressive. Don't fight behind the EV. Fight always fight in front of the EV. Take this control. Take control of this area. Control of this area over there. And you you should be good to go. If your we is taken out in this area, you might have problems. Uh, because the enemy team will place a heal station and uh, some, some tanks over here. Uh, it's really hard to, to repair the AV in this area. So, if you're clocked down here, you've got to raise the pressure on the garage side. If you can take the garage, you more or less have one objective. Uh, you can get this area, you can shoot them over here, you can use the turret to shoot them here, over there. If it's not possible for you to get to the uh, into the garage, or if you're really in trouble, uh, you can go for the long jump. You can go behind it. <laughs> oh, yeah, sometimes I fuck it up. 
takes two or three times. Uh, you can go behind it. And if one is sneaky, two the people wait for them, they just spawn over here. Uh, wait for them until they they are ready to get hit. And uh, once they're in this area, they can off. If you do that, your team has to push. They will try to communicate as much as possible, because uh, the defenders have to fight you first. So it's not that really that important to kill all of them. If you kill one or two, it's already a big advantage. And if you stay alive, uh, they are in trouble. Okay, let's move on. <coughs> You've done the delivery. So now the last objective. I don't know. For me, the last objective is is really hard. Uh, if they set up good defense, y you're in trouble, anyways. Um, yeah, a good point is so we'll get over here. Uh, I don't want to talk too much about it because it's really based on communication. The last objective: if there are three of the enemy team down, you have to take the advantage. You have to push. You have to go together. It's good if. Uh, you can split up as a team, two of them here, maybe one person here, uh, two, two on this side. You have to take cover behind this area, use airstrikes or laser, same here. If they're behind the rock, go with uh, air airstrikes, laser and stuff. Um, if they take cover in here, uh, Nader can be really useful, or Stoker or even Fregat to clear the area under the roof. Yep. Um, that's basically most of it on their attacker side. Just, just remember, be really aggressive. Uh, the more aggressive you are, the, the higher chances uh, you have to win. It. So now I'm going to talk about the defender side. For defenders, yep. Uh, it's really important to have a lot of airstrike guys. I would go with. Four airstrike uh, guys and one medic. Maybe uh, two medics, but uh, first objective as a defender, uh, you can. If you start up here, you can already send an airstrike in this area before the repairs so to avoid them to get to the EV. Uh, and if you can get control of the garage area with the medic, and maybe you go with a stoker or something. That's really good. Uh, or Ardy to to you have ammo supplies and Ardy and Medic is a really good combo in in the garage area. You can take control of this, and as the defender, <laughs> <laughs> always try to to push the attackers at the, the spawn as much as possible. If you can get this area, I don't know. It as as per usual, it's a okay to go with the Medic tank combo. That's what I think is the best. If you can get this area, you can start sending the, the spawn, you can shoot it, just stay alive. Uh, yeah, it's basically... Push push as hard on them as possible. Uh, force them to fight behind the EV. If, if they have to fight behind the EV, you have good chances to win. As per usual, uh, spam as many asterisks as you can, take it out, communicate with each other so you don't waste three airstrikes on one... Uh, on one EV, two two airstrikes uh, are enough, and the others can save it. Keep keep uh, talking about your your airstrike management, about uh, times when it uh, it's ready to go. And again, uh, if they repair, push push as much as you can. Same, they will get to get uh, take this area if you can hold it up here. It's good medic combo. Don't let them take the red building. Just the opposite side of what I said for, for the attackers. Pretty much the same. First attacking, fir first defending spot is of course the two sides of the balconies. Hold them as long as possible. Then next spot is, uh, next time is when they move down in this area. And you can take the spot over here. You can take this spot, you can take the spot over here. Uh, next time you will have to defend uh, is in this area, a little bit more back. Then you can go to this next spot is this area. That's always you, you should be able to take the V out, uh, I don't know, five, six, seven times. 
protected area, then probably the strongest point for defending uh, garage. Uh, one person there or two, and one person in the back. <laughs> yeah, if they have trouble to to repair the EV, you can also go with a with a sniper. Just take out the the uh, engineer always. Always take out the engineer first. And I can't take that. That's pretty much it uh, for for defending. You know the spots. I don't have to say much. Keep the communication. I like this spot. Uh, can take control of this area or over here. Over here, air strikes are good. Healing station should be a, uh, is a must. You sh can place behind the rock uh, if they are spamming the rocks with airstrikes or something. Place it over here, or on this side, uh, tank medic combo. Uh, uh, for the last objective, I would switch to two medics and uh, three uh, three <coughs> tanks or, so or Artie, uh, Stoker, uh, and I don't know Kira, whatever you feel comfortable. One medic tank combo spot here. Maybe one here, maybe one down there, or you can try to de uh, defend a bit more aggressively up here behind the truck area. Up here, it's also a good spot. Up here is a really good spot. You can have control of this area, and you have control of this area. If you have someone in the back uh, who's announcing enemies over here, uh, it's, it's pretty good to hold. So you can have over there. If you have trouble at here, just jump <coughs> down, go back to the medic or whoever is down here. Yeah. I hope that was some helpful information for some of you. I'm um, looking forward to finally play rank games again. And uh, just remember the more aggressive you play on the Chapel, uh, the better you will do. And that's it. Thank you for listening. <coughs>